Now, if you like A5 Wagyu and you like buffets, you're gonna wanna stick around for this episode. We are here in Osaka, Japan, and I'm gonna show you guys an all-you-can-eat A5 Wagyu restaurant here in the Dotenbori area. It is just steps away from the famous Running Man post poster out front. Also, we did an episode in Tokyo showing you guys an A5 Wagyu buffet. So being here in Osaka, I thought it'd be fun to show you guys a restaurant down here that also serves an A5 Wagyu buffet. So sit back, relax, and enjoy seeing this amazing A5 Wagyu experience. Hey guys, I am not kidding. It is literally steps away from this image here on the bridge. And the restaurant is right down here on the fifth floor of this building. Okay, at Rikimaru here, they have three different kinds of courses you can have for the all-you-can-eat buffet. They have the regular course here, they also have the premium course here, and they also have the dotenbori course here. And this is the Wagyu that we're gonna have today. Okay guys, here we are. We are here at Ricky Madu. I'm really excited for this Wagyu buffet. We're gonna put it in order for the special Wagyu they have here, and it's all you can eat, so get ready. Okay guys, here is the keypad, and uh, you can go in English. And we're gonna put our order in here. And this is all the Wagyu there. Starting here. Yeah, extra special rib. Salt and pepper? Yep, salt and pepper. Perfect. Alright, put one order in there. A special sliced? Yeah, there you go. Nice. This one? Yep, special. Right As you see here, guys, the time has begun already. So this is 63 minutes left for us to order. This is the appetizer section here. So you have bean sprouts, you have carrot namur, you have mixed namur. We also have some kimchi here as well. Also we have some other side dishes here as well. You have some lettuce and you have some onions and samgyang. So you can have some other stuff with your uh, wagyu. Right here they have some also some mandu, is some kimchi mandu and the other stuff here as well. So they have a lot of different things here uh, available for you besides the wagyu. Here's the rice section here. So you have rice here. We have bibimbap. Here you also have some noodle dishes here, guys. The cold noodle, spicy noodle. In this area here, you have some soups. Also, we have grilled beef sushi here, guys. We're gonna get this as well. Okay, guys, our order is here. And look at this. I'm gonna show you guys this wagyu. This looks so amazing. Look at the marbling of this beef, guys. We got the short rib, we got the sirloin, a thin sliced uh, Wagyu. Wagyu heaven, buffet style. Here we go. All right guys, we are gonna just start off with the short ribs first and then we'll hit the sirloin and the thin sliced Wagyu later. But here we go. So this is the salt and garlic sauce. And this is the barbecue sauce. And this is at the table. So we ordered some onion and salt and pepper here. Also we ordered some crushed wasabi. So that's something else we can add separately to Wagyu. All right, here it is, guys. Let me go and flip some of this Wagyu. This looks just amazing. Look at this glistening of the fat coming from this beef. All right, we're just gonna try this by itself. Here we go. Mm. Oh wow, it was so meaty, so tender, mmm, such a beefy flavor. Try a little bit with some wasabi. Mm. Wow, <laughs> that is so good. Yeah, try it with the wasabi guys. Wow, it just heightens the flavor. All right guys, also we have the different sauce here, the garlic sauce, barbecue, also a little salt. All right, just gonna dip in a little bit of salt here, guys. Oh. That's so easy, the short ribs. It's meaty and tender 
and the flavor and the juices just kind of explode in your mouth. This Wagyu experience is amazing. Guys, we ordered the sushi Wagyu here. Look at that, and he's gonna torch it. All right, Wagyu sushi. Have you ever heard of that before? Well, we're having it here at this restaurant. But let me show you this. This looks amazing. Yeah, so this came out all raw Wagyu, and they came out by, and they torched it up for us. And they also bring condiments here. Um, they brought wasabi, they brought soy sauce, and they also brought this uh, Japanese herb here as well. All right, dip it in soy sauce here, Just a little bit. There you go. Wow. So buttery, tender. <laughs> it's like reminds me of eating the sushi we had the other day with the um, tuna. So smooth. Wow, try this guys. You'll love this. This is really good. Alright guys, next is a sirloin. Alright guys, this is looking good. Look at that. Oh my gosh. There you go. Ooh. Hot. That, and that is such a tender sirloin piece and it also has a bite, a bite or chew to it as well like the ribs so it's really easy to eat but at the same time it has packs out such a great beefy flavor and it's like you it's just superb all right this is a sirloin part here and we're gonna make a little bit of some with this one and some is a lettuce wrap here we put a little bit in here just like that i'm just gonna put a little bit of the salted onion here and just wrap it up like this there you go Mmm. Mmm. That was an amazing bite. Got sirloin, so tender. It's a different way of eating the, the Wagyu beef here. Had a little bit of lettuce wrap, a little bit of onion and, gar and garlic in there as well. So, a little bit of onion and garlic. Oh, that's a great flavor. Also, we did get some side dishes here. We got some kimchi here, guys. And the kimchi is really good. Okay, guys, we got a dulce bibimbap. It has a clay bowl here. It's really hot. And it also came with cheese. You know, one thing nice about this dulce bibimbap is the fact that they don't give you a lot. So you can still enjoy a little bit of this and also enjoy your Wagyu. So it's just really nice. Gotta be careful, this is really hot. Mmm. Wow, it's so good. I can taste the cheese in it. It's really good. Under normal circumstances, I would not order this, but I'm going to show you guys something else different that's at the restaurant here. Also, never had dulce bibimbap with cheese on it. So, great opportunity to try this as well to show you guys what this is. I'm going to say, eat the Wagyu, but also you might want to try this too. Mmm, so good. All right, we have the thin sliced Wagyu here. Oh, this looks really good, guys. Wow. So this thin wagyu guys cooks really fast, so keep an eye on it. You're looking at probably less than 30 seconds a minute. And maybe less than that. <laughs> Look at that. Beautiful. This is a thin sliced wagyu, and I'm gonna try it with the sauce they offer on the table. Mmm. Wagyu is so good. The garlic sauce with salt in it. It's very strong, so be careful not to put too much on it because you really want to keep the integrity of the Wagyu. So don't put too much sauce on it. Got a little bit of the uh, wasabi. There you go. Mmm. And Ricky Madu, there's actually nine different locations. But the uh, Dalton Body Range location, as well as another location, I believe, are the only ones that offer you A5 Wagyu. They offer you Perillo leaves here. Try this. Put your Wagyu here. Add a little bit of the Namur. Mixed veggies. So it's kind of a sesame kind of flavor, nutty. And then make just one beautiful bite right here, just like this. Mm. 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 Just to let you guys know also, when you get the buffet here, you're required to buy a drink. So I got myself a Coke here. They also have unlimited packages for the Coke or alcohol. It's separate pricing for that, but I just got myself a Coke. I didn't need anything else. 
Mm, good. Okay, and they also offer a tongue as an option as well here, guys. So we all put in order for the thick sliced tongue. Here's the tongue, guys. Really popular here in Japan. Normally you see a lot thin sliced tongue, but this is the thicker cut, so a lot more meatier. So just to let you guys know, this restaurant also has an English menu, has an English touchpad, so you can have everything in English. Also the staff is really good in English as well. We're in the popular tourist area of Dotenbori, so you're gonna have a lot of English speaking people around here to help you out, so, so don't be afraid to walk in here uh, having a wonderful Wagyu here at uh, Ricky Maru. It's real animated here. I don't understand, but it's animated. Also, we have some of the wagyu with the wasabi. Mmm. Unreal. Kimchi. Cucumber kimchi. They bought us broccoli. I don't know if you ordered this or not, but we've got broccoli here. <laughs> Alright, I'll give it a try. Broccoli. Mmm. Good salad. Mmm, sesame on there. Mmm, really nice. Oh, garlic. All right, guys, we also ordered from the special menu. They also have sh uh, short ribs as well. So, this rib looks amazing. The tongue is almost done. Put it off to the side. Finish it up, and then we'll put this rib on here. Look at this, guys. This is a rib. <laughs> Need more room. More room. All right, look at this. This is too big. <laughs> okay, guys, here it is. This is tongue. I'm gonna dip in a little bit of salt here. Here it is. Mm. Tongue, really beefy. And some also more chewy than the regular Wagyu, but a lot of flavor. Mm. Okay, guys, they do have scissors here, so go ahead and cut this meat here in half so we can cook this meat a little bit better. Oh, this is already off the bone. Oh, this looks good. All right, guys, this cavity is done. Short ribs. It looks amazing. Mmm. That's really beefy. Also, it's not as tender as the Wagyu, but the flavor, mmm. Great beefy flavor. Also, we have the dips here too, so you can have like a barbecue sauce on the short ribs. And the short ribs are really good. Also, these are also good for the lettuce wrap. The lettuce up here. The namu here. There you go. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, yeah. That is so good wrap. Mmm. Also, in Korea, we have the kimchi and the meat together, short ribs, so. That's the way to do it right there. Mm. So we have a 90-minute uh, buffet experience here. And you get 65 minutes to order. So we put our last order in for our dessert. And then um, after that, we'll finish up. But for now, I'm going to work on these short ribs. A little bit of wasabi here. Mm. <laughs> you can also eat the namu with the beef by itself. Mm. And our, from our seats here, you can see Dotenbori. This area is the most popular area. You can see a lot of tourists here. All right, guys, here it is, a little dessert. Yeah, this little dessert has taiyaki here, a little fish uh, uh, cake there. Also a little bit of ice cream, a little bit of pineapple. It's a nice little dessert here. I'm gonna pick, oh, it's actually a half. So, Hayaki is cut in half here. Got a little bit of red bean in there. And I'm gonna put a little bit of the ice cream on here. And try this just by itself. Well, mmm. That's so good. Oh, good dessert. Really cute presentation. Has some ice cream, strawberry. Has a little, a little bit of matcha mochi there as well. So you just a little bit of mochi. A little bit of ice cream together. There you go. Mmm, that is really good. Yeah, so dessert is unlimited here, guys. So if you want to eat like five of these, you can have five of these if you want. So 
But uh, save room for Wagyu because there's a lot of wonderful Wagyu here, but also dessert. Yeah, your kids will love this. This Wagyu buffet is an amazing buffet and it's well worth the money, guys. So if you find yourself in Osaka, in the Dalton border area, I highly recommend it. And um, if you like today's video, be sure to give it a like. It uh, really helps out a lot to push out our content to more viewers. And um, yeah, your support really means a lot to me. And uh, yeah, if you haven't subscribed, be sure to subscribe because we have more videos coming up here in Japan and Osaka. I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. As always, guys, I appreciate your support. Have yourself a wonderful day, and we'll see you back in the next video. Bye-bye.